a really quick video updating you on what I'm going to be doing in the next couple months. And if you haven't guessed from the title of this video, I am taking my LSAT on October 1st. Um, the reason why I'm sharing this with all of you is because I know that there have got to be a ton of other girls out there who um, are either preparing for their LSAT that they're also taking on October 1st, who are thinking about taking the LSAT um, in the next year or so, who maybe just took the LSAT and are going off to law school, or maybe you are younger and still in elementary or high school, but your aspiration one day is to become a lawyer. And if that's you, then you're gonna have to go through the same lovely tests that I'm gonna have to go through on October 1st. So I just kind of wanted to throw it out there that if anyone is interested in me um, filming some videos about the process and about studying and organizing for a very big standardized test like this, I also wrote my GRE last summer. Um, so this is kind of a repeat standardized test for me. In Ontario, we don't have to write the SAT to go into university um, for our undergraduate, so I never took that. But these tests are very similar to the SAT in that they are standardized and that there are specific ways you should be studying for them. And you have to take them on a certain day and you have to be prepared and it is a big deal for getting into um, schools. Um, so if you are interested in those kind of videos, please comment in the bar below. And besides that, I guess if you've taken the LSAT and you have any um, comments, suggestions for me, um, advice, anything at all, also please comment in the bar below because I am definitely really nervous. I'm taking a self-guided study course, which really is just um, a company that I really like. Send me the books, the LSAT prep books. They send me a um, syllabus, they send me homework, and they allow me access to online videos. Um, over 50 hours of like a teacher teaching you. So it's kind of like being in a class, but instead you're doing it online. And instead of having a live teacher, it's all pre-recorded. So you're able to self-study, which means you can dictate your own schedule. If you want to work 12 hours one day and then you need to take a weekend off because you're busy that weekend, you can do that. You're not um, kind of locked in to having to work like three nights a week from 7 until 10 or whatever it is. You kind of can dictate that. But at the same time, you're given the guidance from this company who kind of tells you what you should be doing and what steps you should be doing so you're not missing out on anything. And you're not, for the GRE, I never took a course or anything like that. And um, I did perfectly fine. I actually got really good marks on that test. But um, it took a long time to kind of figure out exactly how I should study and to get my head around the test. And for the LSAT, I didn't have enough time between deciding that I was going to take the LSAT and deciding, um, and signing up for it, sorry. So I decided I wanted to do it. I've been thinking about it for a couple months, but I fully decided I wanted to do it only a few weeks ago. I signed up and I only have two months to study. So I didn't have time to kind of get my head around the test. I really just had to start studying right away. And so I haven't started studying yet. I'm taking a diagnostic test today and the um, package should be sent to me tomorrow. So I'll be starting tomorrow, but um, if you have any advice or comments or anything, please leave them in the bar below. And if you'd like to see more videos about how to study for these kind of tests, also let me know in the bar below. And I guess the last thing is just kind of bear with me. Um, for the next two months, it's going to be pretty intensive, my study schedule. And I'm still going to be putting out videos. You should still see about three or four videos from me every single week. So don't worry. And actually, this week is going to be quite a busy week for videos because I have recorded a bunch and I have a whole bunch of back to school ideas and I want to get those out to you before you go back to school so don't worry about any of that but I guess um, if you are also in the LSAT boat with me let me know so we can kind of be LSAT buddies and deal with this exciting mess together and I guess with that I will um, see you in my next video bye guys